everybody, Hooded Cobra Commander 788 here, and this is a quick look at the USS Flag. That's right, this is the big one, the G.I. Joe aircraft carrier from 1985. This is not a full review, she's not quite ready for a full review yet, so we're just going to take a quick look at her today. I've placed a few G.I. Joe jets and helicopters on her deck for scale. And this is me standing behind it, for scale. And here is a cat on the flight deck, for scale. This thing is so big and has so many features that we can't look at all of them this time so I'm just gonna do the highlights starting in the front end here we have like we have some anchors uh, we have a gun we have a radar dish this is carrier number 99 most of the time you see these 99 stickers turned the other way but for a real aircraft carrier the 99 should be oriented this way so I'm gonna keep that I like that now you can see there's plenty of room for sky strikers on here even though sky strikers are pretty large jets you can fit several Sky Strikers on the deck of this aircraft carrier. It's got an elevator over here that the Dragonfly is on. Uh, I've got room for the Tomahawk, which is a huge helicopter, but plenty of room for that. There's even a sub-vehicle, uh, this uh, fuel refueling car with the fuel tanker. There's the vintage Sky Striker, and as you can see, there's plenty of room for it. Lots of room on this flight deck. There's an arrestor cable back here, and then there's this tail hook attachment that can attach to the Sky Striker. We've got guns back here, uh, this fantail. The part that everybody wants to know about is if the fantail railing is there, and I do have the railing. That's a frequently lost or broken part. On the superstructure, we have missiles, this huge missile system here. Um, we've got some, uh, some different levels with some railing on there and ladders. We've got snake eyes hanging out there, a couple of doors. Uh, it has a couple of uh, Y pins here. That are, those are also often missing, but I've got those. Uh, we've got a nice ray dome here and an amazingly complex mast system. And of course, the American flag with the G.I. Joe coat of arms on it. Swinging around to the other side, we have the Admiral's Launch. Uh, we've got the bridge up here with Admiral Keel Hall. Uh, we've got some details in there. We have several rooms. I've got Lady J here manning the radar station. Um, we've got more things down here. We've got a computer computer console. Uh, we've got plenty of space on the inside. Now then we have this speaker system and this is one of the things I'm going to have to replace before I'm ready to do a full review on this. Uh, this speaker system does not work so I will have to get a working speaker system. And then of course we have the the uh, crane over here uh, on this side and I am missing the engine cover for that. So those are a few things that need to be picked up before I'm quite ready to do a full review on this aircraft carrier but it's almost complete and I will have that ready to go pretty soon but this is just an amazing toy it's gigantic it's huge and I just love it that was a quick look at the 1985 G.I. Joe aircraft carrier the USS flag I hope you enjoyed it uh, and stay tuned for more vintage G.I. Joe toy reviews I've got a lot coming up you don't want to miss them I'll see you again soon